In the model phase, we enter the preparation margin on first of all veneer 2-2. We start with a double click and then place only a few clicks along the preparation margin. The software automatically detects the margin and connects the various points. We check it and being satisfied, now activate tooth 1-1 and enter the preparation margin for the full crown 1-1. Next, we define the insertion axis with mesial on the right and distal on the left, with preferably no yellow undercut showing. We confirm this and now select the reference tooth for the software to use as a data source. That is, in our case, tooth 2-1. Then we are asked if we would like the morphology to be copied and mirrored. We confirm this and now click on the incisal area of tooth 2-1 on the model. Now the software proposes the area to be copied. We can either accept or modify this before confirming with Next. Now we are asked to define the insertion axis for the veneer and confirm it as before. The biogeneric calculates and then suggests a proposal, which in this case is nearly perfect. We can either accept this proposal as it is or optimize it using the tool wheel before milling the restoration.